Magandang araw! Ang pag-aaralan natin ngayon ay constants, variables, and algebraic expressions. Simulan natin ito sa isang activity. Determine if the given has a fixed value or unchangeable or without fixed value or changeable. Number one, days of the week. That is, unchangeable kasi mayroon lamang itong araw sa isloob ng isang linggo. Number two, number of deaths every day. Ito ay changeable, hindi pare-pareho ang bilang ng namamatay araw-araw. Number three, number of babies born every day. Ito ay changeable, hindi pare-pareho ang bilang ng mga sanggol na isinisilang araw-araw. Number four, number of hours in a day. That is unchangeable. Mayroon lamang 24 oras sa loob ng isang araw. At hindi ito nababago. Number five, number of months in a year. Ito ay hindi rin nababago o unchangeable. Mayroon lamang tayong labing dalawang buwan sa loob ng isang taon. At hindi na ito mababago. Number six, false rate of each person. Ito ay changeable. Hindi para-pareho ng false rate ang mga tao. Kung Isa-summarize natin ang mga nasa got natin ang changeable ay days of the week, number of hours in a day, number of months in a year. Samantala, changeable ay number of deaths every day, number of babies born in a day, false rate of each person. Kung mapapansin nyo, ang unchangeable ay yung may mga fixed value. Samantala, ang changeable naman ay mayroong iba't-ibang values. Tiyatawag natin ang unchangeable na constant. Meanwhile, saman ang different values naman ay variables. Ngayon, i-define natin ng algebra. Algebra is defined as a branch of mathematics which generalizes the facts in arithmetic. So, it could either be spoken language, letters, and punctuations which are used to create words and phrases. Now, let's define algebraic expression. Ito ay kombinasyon ng isa o higit pang constant at variables kasama ang isa o higit pang mathematical operation. Ano nga ba ang constant? Ulitin ko, ito ay symbol representing a fixed value. Samantala, ang variable ay nagre-represent ng possible values of a quantity. Kadalasan, ang constant ay numbers at ang variables ay letters. Term, a constant or a variable or constants and variables multiplied together. Terms are separated by plus or minus sign. Halimbawa, mayroon tayong algebraic expression na 3x squared plus 5y minus 7. Ang constant dito ng mga numbers sa base ay 3, 5, and negative 7. Samantalang ang variable o mga letters o symbol ay x and y. Ang constant term ay number na walang kasamang variable o letter. Sa ating given, ang negative 7 ang ating constant term. Laging tatandaan, a constant term is a term with no variable factors. 
exponent or power is included when identifying a literal coefficient. If a variable has no number written beside it, the numerical coefficient is now let us solve this example. You have the given 2x. Ang constant dito ay 2. Ang variable ay x. Samantala, there is no constant term. Walang number dito na walang kasama. Letter. Next example. 5y cubed minus 7y plus 2. Constant. 5, negative 7, and 2. Samantalang ang variable o ang letter ay y lamang. Constant term ay 2. Ang 2 ay number na walang kasamang letter. Next given, 7ab plus 4a squared b plus 9. Ano ang mga constant dito? Ito ay 7, 4, at 9. Lagi tatandaan, ang constant ay number na maaaring may kasamang letter ay lahat. Variable. Ang letter dito sa ating given ay a and b lamang. Constant term, we have 9. Next given, 2mn over 5. Constant is 50. Samantala, ang variable naman ay m and n. Constant term, wala. Now let us define numerical coefficient. This is the number factors of an algebraic term. Samantala, ang literal ay variable factors of a term or yung letter. Next, we have this. Given 2x, ang numerical coefficient niyan ay 2. Ang literal coefficient ay x. Number of terms, mayroon lamang isang term sa given. Next, we have 5y cubed minus 7y. Ang numerical coefficient ay 5n. Negative 7. Samantalang, ang literal coefficient ay ang katabi ng 5 ay y cubed. Ang katabi ng negative 7 ay y. So, we have y cubed n. Y. Number of terms, mayroon tayo dalawang terms. Next, we have 7ab minus 4a squared b plus 9. Numerical coefficient, ano yung mga numbers na may kasamang variable or letter? At ito ay 7 and negative 4. Literal coefficient, you have ab and a squared b. Number of terms, you have 3. Next, we have 2mn all over 5. Numerical dito ay 2 feet. Literal, mn. Number of terms ay 1. Now, let us have more examples. Let us identify the constant, variable, constant term, numerical coefficient, and literal coefficient. First one, we have 4x squared. Ang constant ay 4. Variable ay x. Constant term ay none. Numerical coefficient ay 4. Literal coefficient ay x squared. Next given, negative 5xy. Ang constant dito ay negative 5. Ang variable o ang letter ay x and y. Constant term, 9. Numerical coefficient, number na may kasamang letter, ito ay 
negative side. At ang kasama ng negative side ay literal coefficient na xy. Next example, 2n plus 3n minus 3. Ano yung mga numbers? You have 2, 3, and negative 3. At ang variable ay m at saka n. Constant term, you have negative 3. Numerical coefficient, number na may kasamang letter, ito ay 2 and 3. Samantala, ang literal coefficient, it yung letter na may kasamang number. Ito ay M, N. Next, you have 3A square minus 9B plus 7. Ang constant ay 3, negative 9, at 7. At ang variable o letters ay A and B. Constant term, 7. Numerical coefficient, 3 and negative 5. 9. Bakit hindi kasama ang 7? Kasi ang 7 ay walang kasamang variable or katabing variable. Literal, you have a squared b. Again, sa literal coefficient, isinasama ang exponent. Next, given 3xy all over 2. Constant, 3 over 2. Variable, x and y. Constant term, 9. Numerical coefficient, 3 over 2. Literal coefficient, x, y. 